Hi, my name is Rod Martin. I'm the director of training for OS Training, and I'm your instructor for this course. This is the Beginner's Guide to Drupal 8. Drupal is an amazing tool for creating advanced websites and applications, and with the release of Drupal 8, it only gets better. We're releasing this course on YouTube in partnership with Acquia. Acquia supported our Kickstarter project for Drupal 8 videos, and we couldn't be happier to work with them on this series of videos. This is a project-based series, so it's hands-on. Don't worry, even if you've never set up a website before, we'll take you step-by-step -step through the entire process, giving you a comprehensive overview as we do. So here's where we're going. In part one, I'll introduce you to content management systems in general and then get specific with Drupal. We'll talk about why you might want to choose Drupal and what you'll need to do the course along with us. In part two, we'll help you install Drupal so you can use it. Don't worry, it's free. In part three, we'll introduce you to the content workflow. Content types, fields, taxonomy, displays, and views. In part four, we'll talk about how to extend Drupal. Drupal 8 comes with more out of the box than any other version of Drupal. But most people find they need more features. Don't worry, there's a module for just about anything you might need. In part five, we'll help you lay out your site with a great theme, sidebars, menus, and more. In part six, we'll cover the people part of Drupal roles and permissions that govern what people can see and what people can do. Finally, in part seven, we'll wrap it all up and help you know how to properly manage your site. We'll talk about where to get help when you need it and the resources available to you at drupal.org. It sounds like a lot of ground to cover, doesn't it? We'll take you step by step through the entire site building process with Drupal. Just a few things before we get started. This is a beginner level course. We won't be covering every aspect of Drupal, but we'll give you some resources you can use at the end of the course. Number two, this is a participatory course. You'll get so much more out of it if you do the work along with us. Number three, this course is being recorded just before the release of Drupal 8.0. There will definitely be some videos we'll replace once the new version gains some traction, but I'll point those out along the way. Number four, please take some time to visit Acquia's website, acquia.com, to learn more about their products and services. We're so pleased that they are our partner in this course we're releasing for free on YouTube. All right, I think that covers it. Let's dive in.